this video of a high school basketball game is shocking and disgusting. It's from last Friday night here in Southern California. As the only black player on the opposing team comes up to the foul line, you can hear a student yell this. And it gets worse. The player's mom said they only discovered the racist taunts the next day when the teen was reviewing game footage. I'm angry. I'm hurt. I've had emotions. Shalom, shalom, call hala, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. I'm just giving all praise to the Most High Name, His only begotten Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. My name is Abar for the Prophet of Babylon camp down here in Tampa, Florida. I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who teach them well. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect scattered abroad. All right, and in this video, you see Esau, Ben Esau. All right, and what blows my mind, okay, is how you see in the beginning she says shocking. Why is this still shocking to you people, man? Why you people are still shocked by the very foundation of what created america this whole nation has been built off of this man you see so there's nothing to be shocked about but real quick i want to touch on a point okay i just saw this now it's the next day when the look look at look at the sun look whoa, look what's around his neck you see look what's around his neck man okay so you jake still worshiping cesare borgia who you call jesus christ and then when his people jesus christ's people look at you crazy you know or, or, or show you how they really feel about you you surprised you shocked you know all all up in arms you know hey these these devils hate us man okay these devils hate. and listen there's gonna be no mercy no sorrow for any of you edomites man every last one of you edomites are going to pay every last one of you men women children ain't gonna be no mercy on none of you man okay Scripture says, he shall receive no mercy who have shown no mercy. Roughly paraphrasing, you ain't show us no mercy, man. To hell with all of you, man. You jakes that be all up in your feelings, uh, 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 um, turned inside out about trying to save Esau, trying to save these heathens. They come up to the camp, you know, with tears, fucking, you know, dry tears on their face, talking about the heat, the, 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 the heathens. What about, what about the white men? What about the, what, what about them? They're going to be slaves, man. What he said, who let them off the chains? What? What? We're going to put y'all in chains, man. We're going to put y'all in chains for a thousand years. And after that, guess what's coming? Uh, 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 extermination, man. Okay? Mm -hmm. You got to get rid of you. So, okay, let me get rid of that. I'm the next day, when the teen was reviewing game footage. I'm angry. I'm hurt. I've had emotions that have covered the spectrum. Now, the so school district. now if you have understanding... You, if you have some sense, you want to be angry. You want to be hurt. You might be angry, but you ain't going to be hurt because you already know what they expect from these damn devils, man. The scripture says to know thine enemy. Okay, so like, or never trust thine enemy. And you, Jake, your problem is you don't even know who your enemy is. You you love your enemy. You you, you think your enemy love you. You so, Jake will be so fucking bent and turned on the white man and loving the white man. Why y'all hate the white man? To hell with the white man. You know how you got here to America? This man has completely destroyed our people. Look at this damn devil on the screen. <laughs> you know? completely destroyed our people man okay and then they'll put on his face like they really care about you they're so shock shocker shocker it's a shocker that you know you, you, you know you, you, you damn son or nephew out here saying racist no no it ain't no shocker it's how they just how they all talk they hate you a perpetual hatred except d the kid that was yelling those racist slurs and he's been punished how, now, how was he punished? Did he get suspended? Did he get expelled? No, he got he got talked. He got a slap on the wrist. That, don't say that anymore. Don't say it out loud, Tanner. Tanner, don't say that out loud, Tanner. The niggas are going to get mad, Tanner. Don't say don't, don't Don't do that, Tanner. But you can say it when, when nobody's around. You can say it with your friends, okay? You let Edomite my friends when nobody's around. You can do this. You can do that. It's a free country, but don't. It's just, come on. Come on, Okay? This is why it's going to be no mercy for none of you damn devils, man. Hey, through the spirit of your heart, shine, we going to turn up on you fucking devils, man. And you niggas that be trying to be bygones, be bygones with Esau, man. Hey, y'all going to have to die, man. Y'all going to have to go because you ain't, you don't have a kingdom mindset, man. This damn Edomite in what, uh, fifth grade or some shit, talking about some, who let him off the chains? What? What? They, they, they obviously got, got, got their minds in the right position. 
Somebody gonna have to be on them chains, man. And with the problem with Jake is they would rather be. Our people are so fucking destroyed. Is Israel a homeborn slave? They will rather be in the chains than to be putting somebody in the chains. That's why the majority of you niggas, two-thirds of you niggas in America, the Lord's going to have to uh, do an ethnic cleansing, man. Because a lot of y'all just ain't going to make it, baby. It just ain't going to make it. All right? So from there, let me actually go here. 60-second headlines. She is the hideous. Isaiah chapter 15, verse 21. Prepare slaughter for his children. For the iniquity of their fathers. This would be the same Edomite that come up to the camp and say, oh, well, I didn't do it. I didn't have slaves. But y'all boasted about it, man. And really, you did do it because your spirit is back. Your spirit comes back. There is no physical heaven and hell uh, 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 under the earth, you know, where you go out and burn for eternity. No, that's bullshit, man. That's what the white man put over your eyes to make you think that, oh, oh, oh yeah, it's all it's all good. He, he, they got judgment, you know. No, 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 it's so right. They they had they, they they're paying for it right now. No, they ain't paying for it. They went, you know, and, and died in peacefully in they in they in they, they, they plantation houses and woke up in another plantation house. Well guess what? Now it's time for the tables to turn, man. And it's gonna start with you damn Edomites, man. It's gonna start with uh your your children. Prepare slaughter. What is slaughter? Let's grab that real quick. You know, why not, right? You should know what slaughter is. We're going to grab it just to touch on that just a tad bit more. Okay, because our people are, are confused. You don't know what you're a part of, man. You you don't know what the hell you are. Hey, Jake is having an identity crisis, man. How, how you, 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 They beat our ass so bad we got off them ships. Our people still don't know who the hell they is, man. They, they still don't know. They don't even, so, so bad, so much so that they don't even want to know. We need help, man. We need a save. We need salvation. You see? Let's grab this word slaughter real quick. And, and, and excuse me, man. I'm, I'm, I'm a little heated in the spirit, man. Because, you know, seeing shit like this, Strong. it should make you upset, man. You know, scripture says oppression maketh a wise man. Man, we've been oppressed every single fucking day. If you're not mad, you are not wise. You don't have no understanding. You don't know what's going on. I hate seeing a nigga with a big ass Kool-Aid smile on his face, showing all his teeth, grinning from ear to ear. What you happy about, man? What are you happy about? You, we are in the land of our captivity. And the people who are over us, every last one of them, feel like that about you and worse. That's why we call them the devil, because they try to hide it. And say, oh, no, I don't know. No, I, no. We all breathe the same blood, right? B brother, brother. Nah, man. It says, okay, well, you know, there you go. <laughs> it's just pretty much that slaughtering, man. Okay. And you can go, and, and I ain't gonna go all into that word because you are, you know, this is what, what, what we're getting. Slaughtering place, slaughter. So you can go ahead and, you know, go into this word on your own or go into that word slaughter on your own. You know what? For the sake you know, we ain't got much time, but through the spirit of hell, Bosch, man, we're gonna figure it out, man. You see, let's go ahead and grab it, man. Because, you know, you people do not know the Lord and or the spirit of the Lord, man. It says slaughter, the killing or butchering of cattle, sheep, especially for food. Now we gonna not go eat you people, but they got a um the the elites they have they have a term called goyim, which is what they call the people. Okay, nothing but uh cattle, man. They they see you as nothing but cattle, you know, to be controlled, to 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 to, to, to you know to, to to be ruled over, you know, mindless. You know, I'm not saying that cows cows are mindless, but in a way they kind of are. You know, they 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 they're, they're not articulate. You see. It says the br the brutal or violent killing of a person, the killing of great numbers of people or animals indiscriminately carnage. And that's what's going to happen, man. Hey, call Allah, you by Shem Yahushai. Hey, it's going to be a total carnage on you damn Edomites, man. That's it. That's it. Verse one, the slaughter of a, this is where the definition of carnage, the slaughter of a great number of. Uh, it's like the slaughter of a great number of people as in battle. It ain't going to be no damn battle. Okay, you're not going you're not, you're not to be able to, 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 to swing hands with us, man. You're not going to be able to, to, to stand in the ring with us. Ain't going to be no damn battle, man. Okay? There is no battle. There is there is no, there ain't going to be no fight. We got spiritual power. And you're going to just be me, 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 the same measly, weak, pathetic Edomites crying and whining. They always crying and whining. All right? Let's go back to it. <clears throat> Prepare slaughter for his children. Who is his children? 
you modern day Edomites, man, that say, oh, well, I didn't have slaves. Oh, but did your forefathers have, have slaves? Okay. For the iniquity, the sins of your fathers or your forefathers. You can't get around that, man. Okay. You cannot get around it. And this right here is a prime example of why that has happened. Because that same spirit has not left, man. In fact, it's being reborn in these damn devils, man. You see, because hey, they gave you this. That's why that Jake had, had that damn cross around his neck. That cross, plantation Christianity, has been a wool put over our people's eyes to make you fall for the okie doke. To make you simple. To make you naive. To think everything's sweet, man. To make you forgive your enemy and your oppressor who is constantly beating you across the fucking head. To make you forgive him and love him well, as he's still beating you across your head. That is literally the, 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 that's like insanity, man. It says that they, and this is why we're going to prepare slaughter for you damn devils, man. That they do not rise so you never rise again. Never going to go into power again. That's why you say, oh, well, niggas say, oh, well, if we do it. Put them in slavery. They put us back in slavery. You're going to go back and forth, back and forth. No. But for the sake of prophecy, this had to happen. Okay? But after this time, we're never going to go into captivity. Israel has been into seven captivities. We are in the seventh right now. Okay? Under Babylon, the great, which is great confusion. America is great and great confusion, man. I just had a damn, I'm at work right now, so I'm on my break. And I just had a damn, one of my coworkers, who's an who's a, a, a Israelite, female, but she got, she got on fucking like, you know, she, 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 she thinks she a damn dude. That's confusion. And that's only acceptable here in America. That's only been perpetual, uh, 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 perpetrated here in America, man. Okay. On this mass level as it is. Okay. So much so that it spreads to all these other countries, which is why they, which is why they mad too. Okay. They, hey, everybody's tired of this damn devil, man. Even when that day come, hey, man, all the nations going to turn against Esau, man. You see? In the kingdom, we're gonna have uh we're gonna have all you heathen nations in slavery, and we're gonna have you other heathen nations. We're we, we gonna get some, you know, but we're gonna have the other heathen nations beating Edomite's ass, man. Just you know, just you know, just to get a good show. That that, that you know, that's gonna be, you know, um, yeah, man, <laughs> you know, entertainment. Okay. It says that they do not rise nor possess the land. You're not gonna ever get to possess the land again. And how and how do they get these lands? Did they get it fair and square? Or did they go over there uh, cunningly? You know, if you're going to come with the smoke, come with the smoke. They ain't do that. They come over there cunningly. Hey, hey, yeah. We're, we're, hey, we're your friendly neighbors. We're, we're, we're buddy. They, you know, they pull out a sword and start slaughtering everybody. That's how he got everything that he's gotten. By the sword, man. Nor fill the face of the world with cities. So there's never going to be another America again. This is their last hoorah. That's why Trump went up there and said, make America great again. Because America's crumbling, man. When you, know when, you know when America was great? When they had us in chains. When they had us in slavery, man. That's the only time America was great. When, when, you, when you come look at that, eat a, a, a cracker in the eyes. That, that's, when the time, that's when this time was great for them. When you were just a subordinate nigga. Okay? Nothing, nothing more, nothing less. Okay, or, or nothing more, everything less. Okay, um, you know, and, and it's not just the, for the so-called blacks, but even, you know, you, they, they got bow words for all of us, man. You know, you, 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 um, you, you, uh, you, you know, you know, you, you are northern tribes, so-called Hispanics, which means property of Spain. Indian means savage. They demonize you. Okay, and then murder and, and enslave you. Why this man, he demonized you. Who told him he the damn demon? Verse 22, for I will raise up against them, saith Yahweh of hosts, Yahweh of armies, and cut off from Babylon the name. So there's not going to be a name of America ever again. This, this whole, you know, pretty much when you, when you got a name, it means the reputation, okay, of it being great and beautiful. And, and it, they, people used to think in third world countries and shit, they used to think that America's streets were paved with gold. They, and, and, it's, and, you know, when you think about it, and that's how the kingdom of heaven is going to be. They thought America was a kingdom of heaven. This place is hell, man. You got Jake's coming over here from, from that country. I, I look at him, hey, you better, you would bet off where you at, man. It's going to be worse here than anywhere else. It's going to be a complete slaughter here, man. Okay, on both sides. Okay, and cut off from Babylon the name and remnant and son and nephew, say if you how. Now, why does it say son and nephew? Because it's through, the, it's through a male's line, through a man's seed, that a, 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 a race is created, man. Okay, the woman, if a man, if, if, if you know, these Edomite women, 
you know, they get with a Jake. They're, they're going to produce a Jake seed. It may look like an Edomite, but that's a Jake, okay? And even then, it's going to look like a Jake. But, you know, um, when if you have a man, you know, a man is going to push forth, push forth his seed, man. And that's why our women, you ain't supposed to be around here sleeping with no damn Edomites, man. Because you all you're doing is bringing forth your enemy. And then eventually, you're going to see your enemy get slaughtered if you ain't slaughtered with him. It says, um, verse 23, I will also make a possession for the bitterin and pools of water, and I will sweep it with a besom of destruction. See, if you howl of hosts. The Lord is about to jack you damn Edomites up, man. It's going to be a, 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 a mighty time, okay, to see what's about to happen to you damn devils, man. Let me grab this real quick. This is um, Ezekiel chapter 35, verse 1. This is why we do what we do. Moreover, the word of Yahweh came unto me, saying, Son of man, set thy face against Mount Seir. Who is Mount Seir? Which means the government of Edom. Okay? That, that mountain is talking about a government. And, and Seir is, um, so like it will. Mount Seir is the uh, uh, actual mountain that these devils came from. Okay, but that, that, that's describing, that, that's talking about symbolic code for you damn Edomites, man. They ain't come out here and say no damn uh, Caucasians. Or they ain't come out and say white people. They ain't even white, man. That's all some damn witchcraft shit. But that's besides the point. It says, and say unto it, thus saith the Lord power, Yahweh Shem Shai, behold, O Mount Seir, you Edomites, I am against thee. No, he ain't with y'all. The Lord is against y'all, man. And I will stretch out mine hand. Against, I will stretch out mine hand against thee, and I will make thee most desolate. The Lord said, he "Man, he gonna destroy you, man. Make you desolate. He's going to obliterate you. I will lay thy cities waste, and thou shalt be desolate, and thou shalt know that I am Yahweh." Hey, y'all gonna know who the true power is, man. Right now, it's funny. You want to scoff. You want to mock. You want to play games. You want to, you know, talk shit on your breath. And, you know, and, you know what Edomites do is now you tell them, to, what? No. You know, they act like, act, like, act, like, act like it ain't real. Act like it's, it's the most absurd hurt thing they've ever heard in their life. But deep down inside, they know, damn, oh, shit, they know, they know. You know, it's, you know, it's, they don't sound too good. They're angry about it, man. So the Lord said, you're going to destroy y'all, man. And this is why. Because thou hast had a perpetual hatred. And has shed the blood of the children of Israel. No, the whole world. Of the children of Israel. This man has, has shed the blood of people over the whole world. Look at what he did to Hiroshima and Nagasaki, man. I remember one time I was on a game and it was a um it was a little Asian girl on there. And it was an Edomite dude. And he was, you know, some you know, slick talking ass Edomite, but he was saying a bunch of stupid shit or whatever. And I told I told and the little Asian girl was kiki -ki -ki laughing and shit. And I say, What well, what you what you were laughing about? You know how you know how the game is. Or Call of Duty, or whatever. I said, What you were laughing at? You ever heard of Hiroshima, Nagasaki? And she just got she just got quiet. She just got quiet. Like it like it brought back a flashback or something. Like her grandparents told her about that shit. And she she and, she, and now she remembered. And her whole demeanor, attitude, and everything changed towards that Edomite, man. Okay, so we come into a time where not just us, but all these nations are gonna be on your fucking neck, Esau. Okay, you 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 going you y'all gonna be getting ran off them at I, 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 the damn stadiums, man. It's gonna be on and popping, all right, and have that same energy, all that all that, all that sweet talking shit, all that da, 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 all that running your mouth. Have that same energy when we we when 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 the rabbit got the gun, man. Okay, when we when we in our day, when we in our kingdom, have that. I want I would love. For you, Edomite, to say the same shit. I, I, you know, I, I pray that the Lord give us the power, which we, we will have the power, to make y'all sit here and, and requote everything that you ever said about a Jake in your past life, man. You're going you you to be able to stop your mouth. You're going to be just spewing out madness you've ever said in your past life to a Jake. And every single word, you're going to get your ass struck for it, man. The Lord is raising up kings. You men, but hey, you Israelite men, y'all better get your minds right, get your head out of the gutter. Stop chasing these women. Women supposed to chase you, man. In the world, they say, let your nuts hang. Well, concerning this truth and this truth, let your nuts hang, man. Get on fire for this thing. Be real about, hey, get, get real about this thing, man. It says, um, because thou hast shed, has had a perpetual hatred, which means never ending since the beginning. They, this is hatred ain't ended, man. They, they, these motherfuckers still hate us, man. Y'all think you niggas think, oh yeah, well it's not like it's the old days. The old days is about to come the new days, motherfucker. Even heard none? Hey, if you don't if you don't learn your history, it repeats itself. Even that guy Trump told you that. 
It says, because thou hast had a perpetual hatred and hast shed the blood of the children of Israel by the force of the sword in a time of their calamity, in the time that their iniquity had an end. Therefore, as I live, saith the Lord, power Yahweh Shai, I will prepare thee unto blood. You need love blood, right? If they love the slaughter, they love they, 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 they love to um, they love genocide. I will prepare thee unto blood, and blood shall pursue thee. Hey, 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 that blood, hey, what they say, get it back in blood. People gonna want to get it back in blood, man. The Edomites are going to be, uh, um, 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 it's going to be open season on y'all, man. So if thou has not hated blood, you, 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 you don't hate to kill. You know, you love killing. <laughs> Even blood shall pursue thee. So hey, the Lord said that blood, that blood gonna pursue you, man. All, 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 all the smoke you brought gonna get brought to you. Okay, thus. I will make Mount Seir most desolate and cut off from it him that passeth out and, and him that returneth. Hey, every last one of you, man. Okay, every last one of you. And nothing no, no, you can you you must can run and hide, man. It's over. And they, and they know it. All right, but that been said, I'm gonna say Shalom, Kwame Sharala. Um, a Bible ball, man. You know, praise this was edifying to the spirit. Um the um the water you give spirit through this lesson. Let me get back to work before they start tripping. Shalom, man. Hey, we, we we still on the plantation, but hey, brothers and sisters, our time is coming. Okay, have faith, be patient, and trust in Yahweh Shai. With that being said, I'm gonna say Shalom.